hi guys welcome back to our youtube channel it's another day hopefully everyone is doing well well i'm doing fine <coughs> so for you guys i wanted to tell you about my <laughs> and i told you guys i don't i don't think i don't say things i don't know i don't gossip about people because i am a person who doesn't want to speak about things that I don't have proof of or things that I have never seen before but one thing I know is <laughs> like I'm in the situation where I'm supposed also to talk about it at the same time you guys you know I don't know if you face it the same but when you marry to a foreigner <laughs> you know, most people you have since you mar you're married to different culture, especially for me being a black woman, or the way from Africa and married to Benai and living here also in his country, it's kind of challenging. But that is not my problem today. <laughs> my issue is it's my brother. My brothers that marries outside the race. You guys, I don't know what is your problem. Hmm? Dating us first was not our problem. It's just a situation that we found ourselves in. And I think if it was a burden, we're supposed to share it together and move on, be happy, find happiness. I don't know if many of you and trust me you cannot tell me that I'm lying this 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 boys when they go there they like I don't understand if I go there you don't have words to use to roll these women or talk to them why don't you just use your honest word I'm not saying all of you but I know most of them this my african brothers when they are going to talk to this women they make uh, they make us look bad huh? they make us the exes look bad hmm? like what have we ever done like really to deserve that kind of treatment it's not like we were all happy when things ended hmm? let's say we all made a mistake by being together we met, we connected, it didn't work out. Now we find each other in the different area. If you're going to talk to this woman, be sincere. Huh? You don't go there like to them, how we treated you bad, how we don't respect, how we look at hard working, or maybe so and so. And as you guys, you know, like women, when we hate, if you hurt my husband, trust me, I'm going to hate you. If you say something bad about him, um, I might not fight you. But trust me, we, we won't be friends. Hmm? So these people, they make it personal. Hmm? You, you pass by the brother who really have also a foreign woman. The woman starts look at, looking at you like as if they know you deserve giving you the, the side eye. Huh? <laughs> they start giving you a side eye and it's kind of like, really, do I know these people? Or maybe traveling you know, like on the bus, the same bus, you start to see that. You know? <clears throat> and really, I know the feeling, I know, I know. But... For me, on the other hand, my my life is kind of different. I'm a person who doesn't fight other people's war. If you're fighting with my friend, I'm not going to fight you, but that doesn't mean I'm going to be your friend. That's how it is. So, my dear brother, if you're going to, if you fall in love with someone else outside your culture, don't make your culture also look bad. A human being. Maybe also this 
other culture when you marry there. Also, maybe the same, same, same goes to them. But I don't think it will be an issue of you having a conversation with your soon-to-be partner for life, how bad these people treated you. Yeah, maybe me, myself, I can talk about my exes, they were like this, they were like that, but I will not just put them in a bad position. Because, yeah, we both made a mistake. We are not going to re- to erase it. It happened, it happened. But, yeah, move on. Imagine they just women, they treat us bad, they love so much money, they don't take care of us, they don't even give us emotional support. Did you give it to them in the first place? So, let's not take sides, guys. Let's just help each other here. And once it doesn't work out, let's move on. And Because, like, every day life changes. Let me drink my milk also. Every day is a lesson and we go through it. When others are loving each other, others are breaking up, or others are having fights, that's life. But don't try to look a fight with your neighbor because they are happy and you're not. So, my dear brothers, don't make us look bad. Don't make us look bad. We didn't do anything. We just, that we... It's a matter of that we all end up in the in the place with the wrong people but it's not all of our fault no? some we use the issue of it was not meant to be others were like <laughs> there's so many reasons and it's painful for everyone but once you're already done with that chapter yes we have a grieving Grieving moment, like ooh, you wasted a lot of time, especially for those who who stays in relationship one year, two years, five years. You're just boyfriend and girlfriend. What? Are you ready? Are we waiting for each other to ripe or something like that? My grandmother used to tell me that whenever she asked me, when are you getting married? I'm like, yeah, maybe next year. Like, what are you waiting for? Are you waiting for to ripe? <laughs> <laughs> waiting, or you're waiting for a mass that conducted just for you. So, for those people who have been in relationship eight years, five years, even three years, even one year, you just you wasted a lot of time. And the homeboy wake up and like, oh, I don't think it's going to work. What? Three, <laughs> three years. You're telling me it's not going to work. That is really painful. <laughs> in my point even if it's just a day you can't just waste my time and just come and tell me that yeah but that hard but after after you already been through this you cried you picked up your broken heart you broken like what you fixed yourself you pulled yourself together now you're happy you met someone you should be thanking the person because like, they let you go, you found your happiness. For those who are still crying, keep on, don't cry. You can keep crying or just stop. It is up to you how long you want to be broken hearted or... Mm. <laughs> so guys, that's how it is. Love and love and love because love is free. Love is kind. Love is beautiful. So if you find someone who loves you, don't use it. Don't use us. So don't use us. Don't use us as past to pass through the future. The past is past. Move on. I know most ladies, they want assurance, like, maybe you feel like, oh, is he not going to find someone of his kind? Even if the same for some men, feel like, oh, she's going to leave me, go with a 
her own kind but the moment she chose you she chose you the moment he chose you he chose you so believe that you are the best and you are the only person for that person so and be happy so i love you i leave you <laughs> for now with my chit chat be back next chapter so god bless you stay safe always malamang salamat and of course now tea